Hello everybody, and welcome back to Aurora Plays Baldur's Gate 3. I am your humble host, Tim. Uh, it's been a while since I've actually uh, played this game. We played through uh, the early access pretty much right back when it first came out. Uh, really year and maybe two years ago now, I can come to think of it. Uh, actually, let me check that. There you go, the first video that I uh, uploaded for Baldur's Gate 3 was exactly one year ago today, so there you have it. A little bit of coincidence there. So yeah, basically what I've done is I've gone through and I've played through the, the tutorial level uh, in uh, Avernus, which I was actually quite impressed with. They've definitely upped the graphics level on it. Uh, they've also given you the ability to uh, get Shadow Heart out of the um, uh, the pod, so she can assist you during the uh, the final battle. Uh, you're not just stuck with uh, Lazel. But uh, for now, let's uh, get into it. I'm loading in as the uh, just after the crash. So I'm going to see what other updates they've made to the game. Uh, once more I built Aurora pretty much identically as before but this time well no he's still a rogue as they have not introduced a bard class. Very disappointed. I thought about running him maybe as a druid since that was the latest class they developed but Aurora's not a druid he's a bard and the closest thing to a bard that they've got is the rogue or the arcane trickster. A little bit intensive. There's the man with his dirty face. Best be on my way. Ah, here we go. And the trouble is, I've got to remember Another not. Step forward. Uh, ooh. Oh, hello, Shadowheart. Uh, I guess I'll wake her up because I don't think uh, the artifact will. Oh, you know what? Screw it. Let's let's live dangerously. <laughs> what are you doing? I was just checking to see if you were alive. I'm alive. Yes. Thank you for the concern. Mm. And speaking of, how are we alive? Uh, I was hoping that you might know that. I remember the ship. I remember falling. The nothing. Uh, what happened to our gith friend? You might want to reconsider calling her a friend. Looks like she ran off without us. Oh, we should look with her. She might be injured or even worse. You're more concerned for her than she is for you, clearly. We need to take care of ourselves. First things first. We need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. True. Uh... Oh, we? So you want to stay together? We need each other. And we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. Fair enough then, let's get moving. One thing, just before we go. I wanted to thank you again for freeing me. It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod, but you didn't. I'll remember that. Aha! Uh -huh. Lead the way. Okay, well that's different again. Because in the the last time I met up with her, she was banging on one of the doors up ahead. No traps, please. <laughs> yeah, fish, intellect Put up about. A fight by the looks of it. Not that it mattered in the end. Ugh. Wouldn't wish that fate on anyone. What fish? Ah. Here we go. Fresh water. There must be a settlement nearby. 
Ah, uh, yes. And we row with the spray on our backs, and we row with the spray on our backs, and we row with the sea beneath our feet, and the pitch queen stays the storm. Yes, never quite got the, uh... Alright. Light on my feet. Checking all the bodies, all the bodies. Ah, yes, the perfume letter. If I remember correctly, it was for someone. Where are we? Yes, I love you. There, I said it. And if we meet tomorrow, I'll stay again and again. And keep saying it until we're old and grey. Let's do it. Let's go to Baldur's Gate. I know it's risky. So staying here, the last few months have been hard, but they're always a little easier when you're there. Leave your boat and meet uh, at the hill overlooking the old bridge. Alright, so we've got to try and find Anna. I don't think we ever... I don't think I ever found her in the previous game. Yes, the last time... Ah, uh, yes, that's the waypoint. Yes, the last time uh, Shadowheart was here. Let's use my mighty lockpick picks. Ding. Ah uh, yes, let's add guidance to it. There we go. Oh come on! <laughs> Bugger. That was my last lock pick too. Oh well. Why is my head glowing? Oh, I've got guidance. Right. Okay, that's cool. I'm actually curious. Is there a way? If not over, then through. Okay, tabbing puts the weapon away. Let's actually check the in the Ah, there it is. Never wanted the easy path. Don't waste a step. Something good here, I hope. Ooh. There we go. Breathe deep and move. Let's try it again. Uh then I can crack that open. And they've updated the dice roller as well. Oh god damn it! Through here, then. How much farther can I go? More of those wretched things. Swift as my feet can carry me. Ah, uh, right there, there. have seen everything. Ah, oh, I'm not in range. Okay, hang on. Let's go keep moving closer. Good. 
turn. They were so surprised. Were you surprised? I was surprised. There we go. Oh, nicely done, Shadowheart. Got to press on. Ah, motherfucker. Okay, do the help action and get me up. Let's check the bodies. Uh, so that's what it was. All right. So there's, of use? There was a button that was the highlighting thing. Okay. What's in here? Again, having to relearn the control scheme for this game. No, don't attack the Nautiloid tank. Open up. There's a cartilaginous chest. Basic poison, which, if I remember correctly, you can actually attach. You can apply that to your weapons. Uh, ooh, reducted nobleman, eh? Ooh, ah, oh, yes. Crouch. How do I go to my character sheets? Equipment. Character sheet. Here we go. Aha. Yes. Not kind of the thing. Ooh, an elaborate key. Okay. Oh, that was from earlier on. wonder if the gods are watching me. If I remember correctly, there was a bunch of people out here that were very upset, but no, they're no longer here. Need to find a way forward. They're going forward. You gotta go up this hill. saying hello. Ah, there we go. Ah, here they are. <sighs> More survivors? They're trying to dig somebody out of the wreckage. Shiver! Something's wrong. Come on, dig! Faster! Get her out of there! <sighs> Don't die! Don't die! Don't They're die. trying to dig the mind flare out. The person they're trying to save. It's the creature from the ship. Still alive, but wounded. Um. Yes, it's clouding your minds. Look what's, what's in front of you. Can I add a bonus to that? Yes, give me some guidance as well. Aha! Exit. Your voice cuts through the fog of confusion. You can see the creature's hold on you wavering. As its influence wanes, they clutch their heads, blinking in confusion. Where... where are we? There was... fire in the sky and... and then... the voice... Oh, gods, the voice! 
What happened? I was using you like a puppet, I'm sorry to say. God. I, I think you're right. It called out from the wreckage. It sounded just like my daughter. Oh. But she's been dead for years. That thing got into our heads, drove us mad. We wrecked our boat just trying to get close to it. What do we do now? <sighs> um. Well, can your boat be repaired? Not a chance. It's bloody driftwood. And we're in the middle of nowhere, and even. Oh, wait. You. I can feel you. Just like one of those things. You're one of them. Uh. It's calm down. They abducted me, but I escaped. There's something in your head. Yeah. Please, we'll take our chances out here. Just, just leave us be. Oh, he's very. Uh... Uh -huh. Let's have a chat with this guy then. You approach the dying monster. This is the thing that abducted you. Yeah. It could end its life here and now. If only you didn't feel compassion. <gasps> compassion. Um. No, I should be. Sh I should be furious, shouldn't I? Yes, you feel hate, and you deserve to be punished for it. Oh man. You should be whipped. Hmm. Made to bow before this creature in shame. Ooh. But I might it's like that. Possessing your mind. Ooh. Forcing you to love it. Well, I dated worse. But then the feeling slips. The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. Uh. I'll concentrate on its thoughts. Ha <laughs> ha! Your mind spews, lusting for something that is gone. But then, its grip claws back with a vengeance. A vice locking your mind into obedience. No! It needs sustenance to survive. And with your very body, you can provide. Get out of my brain. I'll resist the intrusion. Ha <laughs> ha! I do like the new dice roller, that's really good. The monster lies exhausted, defeated. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Uh, I'll close those eyes forever. Stab, stab. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Level up! Always talking about. I need to get to level four to have the uh, any significance. I think level three is when you choose your. Uh... Ah, that's cool. Good to know. Uh, okay, let us keep moving Never then, I guess. The Wait, I know that was the way we came in. Was it? Very well. Oh, we should check the Mind Flayer's body. Speed, a caustic bulb, and a spiked bulb. Very good. Oh. Whoa. What you doing there, Shadowheart? Uh, let me see. I've got water, I believe. Grease bottle. Water. Here we go. Ha ha! Now, 
if I remember correctly, Lazel is captured in a net up here. At least the last time she was, anyway. Yes, there they are. The two tieflings have got her. Zoru was right. Yellow as a toad and twice as ugly. <gasps> the thing's dangerous. Leave it for the goblins to kill. <gasps> and if it escapes, how will you? Oh, a guest. Hello there. The skull powers in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. <laughs> her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. You again. Get rid of them. Um. No. This creature is dangerous. Get out of here. Leave it to me. Oh shit. Oh, good thing, too. <laughs> He's right. Let's go. We need to check out that blast. Uh, a blast? Could you be more specific? You didn't hear it. Shook our camp good, so we came for a look. Yeah. Um, I'm in dire need of healing. Where is this camp? Ooh, I'm very charismatic on this one. Northwest. Look for Nettie. Whatever your wound... She can mend it. Thank you. And be careful. There are goblin traps everywhere. Nymessa, come. <laughs> Enough gawking. Get me down. Uh, say please. Never. Okay, fine. <laughs> Need to find a way forward. Observe. Uh. Listen. Enough, dawdling. You'll hear Get goblins before you see them. Uh, you gotta shoot the base out of this, don't I? Yeah. Aha! The tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. But the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You will join me. Careful. She obviously sees your kindness as weakness. Don't let her take advantage. Um. What exactly is a crash? It is many things: a hatchery, a training grounds, a shelter. Githyanki protocol is clear. When infected with a gate tadpole, we must report to a caretaker for purification. All right. Well, a simple thank you wouldn't go amiss, though. You may as well suggest a wyvern bow to worms. <laughs> the cure I offer will suffice as thanks. Very well. We'll journey together. Let's go find this Kresh. You have made an ally from Kresh Kalir. Few know such fortune. Call me Lazel. Fool. No point in showing a mad dog kindness. It'll still bite you in the end. <gasps> You've a sharp tongue, elf. Would that your mind proved its equal. Ooh. Half elf. I suppose the finer details are lost on a creature like you. <sighs> Come. The Horned Ones mentioned a camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. We will ask this Zoru where he has seen my kin. Very well. That whole half elf thing, that was, what's the name, Nera from Baldur's Gate 1 and 2. Because it's like, all right, elf, half elf. <laughs> the wild mage. I wonder if the gods are watching me. I hear shouting up ahead. Ah, I got the we goblin. Check it out, but be careful. The goblin battle at the gate. Moving ahead. Gate. Nobody gets in. Zevlor's orders. That pack of goblins will be on us any second. What's going on? Whoa, his tail's going crazy. On our tail. Open the gate, Zevlor, now. You let goblins here? Where is the druid? 
Oh man, the guy's tail's going insane. Jeez, good catch, guys. That would have busted your backs. So Will's actually joining the fight right off the bat. That's awesome. Uh, yeah, let's run up here. Lazel go stab the crap out of that guy. No, or not. Nice. Uh, that's it for you. Action me and bonus action. You still got some movement. Move up to here. End the turn. Damn it. <laughs> Wake up, Aurora. Gaping wounds. Ignis. Ow. There we go. Now Shadow Hunt's up. You help and wake me up. Stop. Thank you. one Lazel. Yes, we'll move to here. Ranged attack in the ass. Ha ha! Bonus action hide. I don't need any attention right now. <laughs> That was a critical miss. He's too damn far away. Oh. Nice. Have to keep going. What have we got here? Guiding bolts. There we go.
Ooh. Ah, you lost your concentration, Lazel. That Lazel should have had. Can I get to this guy? No, I can't. Can I get to that guy? No, I can't. Alright. Hang on. Oh, 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 oh. Even got blade flourishes. Awesome. Very much like a uh, a sword bard. Eat candy. Ha ha ha. Bow. Dash action. And I'll just give him a push. Stuff to check. We have bodies to loot. What are we doing? Let's have a look. Ooh, gloves of power. What's inside? Should mind my step. A metal fork. Don't waste a step. All right. Step forward. Garden bar. Ah, oh, that's right. There are children here, you fool! We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too. Unbelievable! Uh One fight has just ended. Now you're picking another? Relax? No. Yes, Druid. Those goblins don't take prisoners. We lost him back at the ruins. Whole place is crawling with gobbles. He trusted you. Nobody forced him to go with us. He insisted. And when things got tough, he couldn't keep up. Simple as that. My God, you're a coward. The human's eye twitches. He's about to blow. Uh. I knocked the human down.
damn it. Missed. He acts before you can intervene. Should have done that a long time ago. Arrogant prick had it out for me from day one. No one leaves my people out cold. Uh, you put him in a bind, showing up like that. He did try to open the gate. Too little, too late. He was right, though. Coming back to this hellhole was a mistake no amount of gold can put right. I'd rather face another round of goblins than stay in this pit. Uh, I have to keep going. Oh, hang on. Let's check for healer, then move on. Whatever else is happening here isn't our concern. Um, well, let's not be too hate pasty. These people might need help. We won't help anyone if we turn into mind flayers. That's true. Let's move. All right. Wakey, wakey. A cheap shot. I should have expected that. You all right? I'll survive a sore jaw. Particularly if it's rid the grove of Aradin. Whatever your business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. Um. So why are they forcing you out? There have been several attacks by different monsters. The druids blame us outsiders for drawing them here. Nobody's welcome anymore. Mm. They've started a ritual to cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay, but we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We're no fighters. Hmm. Well, I'm in need of a healer. Goblin got you. The druid Halsins a renowned healer. But he didn't make it back from Aradin's expedition. No. If it's not too serious, you could try his apprentice, Nettie. She's with the other druids in the inner grove. They've withdrawn there to prepare this damn ritual of theirs. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, there's no way to convince them to stop it. Yes, well, I know there isn't, but I'll just do the I've bit. tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. You, though. I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her for more time to prepare, if nothing else. I'll see what I can do. Let's not forget why we're here. No point in wasting precious time on a lost cause. We'd owe you a great debt. If we're forced to leave now, we won't make it to the city. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense before more lives are lost. I liked how they got Will into the fight at the gate, because that wasn't part of it the last time. Since he is the, uh, the blade of the frontiers, he should be the one helping defend. how we level up. Ah ha, ha ha There we go. <sighs> ah, she gets action surge now. Awesome. Now, if I remember correctly, we've got our the Blade of the Frontiers over here. We've also got 
the little girl about to be killed by a snake with the main druid area and Nettie attempting to kill the shit out of you <laughs> as, as her cure. So we'll see if we can't find Will. Get him to join up with us and then we'll go visit the, uh, the druids. That sounds promising. There is the man. Children. Go on. Give me a best shot. <laughs> Not bad. Again. <laughs> Hey, hey, keep focus. See how I used your own force against you? Ugh. I can't do it. <sighs> of course you can. It just takes time. I didn't become the Blade of Frontiers overnight. <laughs> uh, hey there, can I have a word? The man's smile bends downward and his thoughts become yours. An unknown face commands your mind. Blue skin, gnarled horns. Chuck, he is infected. I'll be damned to the hells. You are on the ship. A strange sensation courses through you and Will's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. I was indeed. Uh, I didn't do this last. I'm actually going to try this one. Illithid Wisdom. No. Oh, class zero. Cool. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. The creature appears again. Blue skin, arched horns, and wings stretching wide behind it. Your minds part again, leaving your skull throbbing. Ouch! Careful you don't push the brain bugs too far. They'll leave you hurting. <laughs> Keep at it, kid. If I had to guess, you took a bumpy ride on a mind flayer machine, same as me. And I've been having the strangest dreams. I haven't turned into a mind flayer just yet. But sooner or later, my luck will run out. Been thinking I need a healer. And I reckon you've been thinking the same. Indeed. Um, I'd hope someone in the grove might know how to heal us. I've been waiting for this druid house in to return. They say he's pretty powerful. He could probably help us. Problem is, the goblins have nabbed him. We better go find him before we start growing talons and tentacles. All right, we can look for Halson together. Excellent idea, but I have a condition. Ooh. Go on. Look at these kids. They've no chance on the road, not while goblins infested. I've got the grandest of plans. You and me. We kill the Goblin Horde's leaders. That should scatter the buggers. Frontier justice, I call that. What say you? I'm on board. Let's clear the road for the tieflings. Splendid. It's time for some old-fashioned hero work. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, so we've got Will. Okay, so ah, oh, the grove is this way, so I got turned around. Cause I remember last time I got—I didn't realize you could just walk around to get in there, and I climbed down into the bloody drove, the grove, I should say. Hmm. He stares right past you as if you're invisible or boring. Oh, are you all right there? Mm-hmm. Um, anything else on your mind? Mm. 
He's still <laughs> staring right past you. Uh, I'll see what he's looking at then. You see nothing out of the ordinary. When you turn back, there's no trace of the child. Whoa. Ninja skills. I like how they've actually updated the way the clothes work. So, like, the more beat up you get, the more dirty your clothes are. Uh, a collector of valued objects. Hold out your hand, mister. Let me show you something. Okay. Whoa. Go on. Take this ring. It's lucky. Um... Nice sleight of hand. Hammers flourish, right? Uh, I never learned names or anything. Just the tricks. Anyway, forget that. Take the ring. I want to show you how lucky it is. Um, I shall take the ring with a reverse hammer's flourish. <laughs> Double 19. <laughs> Weeping, bleeding hells! Okay, maybe you don't need extra luck. But since you're already holding the thing, call it heads or tails. Well, I will go tails. Of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. I've got more where that came from. Real cheap, too. Interested? Um. You do know you can drop the act, right? We're sort of the same in terms of our magical prowess. I uh, don't know what you mean. Uh. Anyone could see it's a modified War Widow scam. The hell it is! You can't do that one with rings. It has to be with bracelets because. <laughs> oh damn! No, no, please go on. Last chance. You want to look at my stuff or not? Uh, here's the ring. Let's trade. I knew it. Hang on. That's what I got. Ooh, I got inspired. All right. Shadowheart is inspired as well. That's cool. Ring of being really invisible. Ring of infinite wishes. The ring of resistance to ants. <laughs> Ink pot, a fork, a bucket, a baguette. I like the thieves tools, I got the coins for that. Ooh, and a bagel. Take that. That. Can I do both? Okay, so I'll trade that, and then I'll take that and that. There we go. Yes, I have gauntlets of power. Uh, Alright, Q. something most everybody says it looks like junk and moves on oh no i just wanted to uh support a young businessman a woman oh you have you definitely have anyway see you again sometime take care safe travels you realize your bag feels let's think what do they steal off me yeah you were just robbed motherfucker <laughs> hey, you're back. Here to buy some stuff? 
Have you taken something that doesn't belong to you? Me? No, promise. I'm just a kid trying to make a living. Mm -hmm. You know who you should talk to? Mal. She's my boss, I guess. Good at finding stuff. Her office is through the crack in the wall over there, if you can fit. <laughs> There's the crack in the wall. Ah. So this is definitely new. Swift as my feet can carry me. Ah, the rocky crevasse. Here we go. I can't fit through here. Wonder if there's another way in. All right. Cheeky bitch. One day I'll catch a break. Right, let's go see the druids. Let my daughter go right now. She's a thief, hell spawn, and you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back. Oh, let me through, Ragrashev, or I'll rip your damn throat out. <laughs> Hello. We could help each other, fight the goblins together. Instead, these fools are trying to chase us away. Oh, that's Lazel. Yeah. Great talent or not, no druid can cleanse an embedded tadpole. Give no credence to such fantasy. Uh. Are you sure the crash is the only path to a cure? Entirely. I was as devoted to my studies as I was to my training. Ah. To all questions, the Kalir Library harbors answers. A gift from Vlakith herself that we may gain total understanding. Oh, that kind of wisdom is very valuable. Countless scholars roam the astral sea and beyond, observing the ways of our lessers. Exploring planes so distant, order turns to chaos, and cold fires rage. The planes are ever quaking, and their peoples ever shifting. The Githyanki possess an eternity of knowledge. Yet we still collect more. Infinities upon infinities. Hmm. Alright, let's keep going then. Uh, so let's lay Zell. Are at stake, and the cowards only care about their bloody rituals. Yeah. Where's? Oh, there they are. Keep this up, and you'll have blood on your hands. We need to get Arabella out now. You heard the guards. They're waiting on Corker to give word. I'd sooner trek through the nine hells than trust that snake. Ugh. Uh, I saw what happens. Why are the druids holding your daughter? Arabella tried to steal their idol. Druids lost their damn minds about it. They need it for their precious ritual. Oh, it's all my fault. I told her I wished the wretched thing would just disappear. Or better yet, explode. Now Arabella's being judged by a bunch of druids who hate us. That's not right. Not at all. Sounds like she made the fatal mistake of getting caught. Ooh. We shouldn't get involved. Well, they're going to be. Yes, I'll talk to them. She's just a child. Thank you. They won't give us the time of day. Hurry! I'm at the end of my tether as is. Can't take this waiting. I could take one of the guards, maybe two. Oh, here we go. Mm. Give him a chance. Thank you. Get back. Um. Yes. Why? What's so special down here? It's forbidden to outsiders. Corga's orders. Well, if it weren't for me, it'd be over run by goblins. No. Oh, look, I'm not looking for trouble. Can't you just let me by? 
No, and you'll find trouble all the same unless you get out of my sight. Ooh, cinematic pending. Ah, oh, it hasn't happened yet. Right, okay. A moment, Giona. What? Oh, I understand. You. Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. Hooray. Ooh, this has changed. So that's the idol that we're using. More effects on there. Good evening, all. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. Um... Imprison her? She's just a child. She's a parasite. She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Korga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. The child's in danger. Do something, I beg you. Um... Yes. Release her and I'll see that she stays out of trouble. Oh, you fuck. God damn it. Oh, roll again. Yes. Ha ha! I forgot I had inspiration. Very well. She may go. Break your word, and my serpent shall feed. Sivisiv, Tila to me. Out, thief. My grace has its limits. Thank you, Korga. Sivisiv. Master Halsin would... Halsin isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. Oh. Yes. Uh, not on my watch. Shadowheart is inspired. Away she goes. Oh well, that went better than last time. Very well. You did well to speak up for the girl. That snake is fickle. A tragedy prevented. Uh, yeah, she seems kind of dangerous. That uh, that cargo. Well seen. Well spotted. We've let a snake replace our leader. Mm. So, how'd she take over the grove? She is first druid in Holson's absence. With him caught or dead by goblins, none may gainsay her. Yeah. But more will die if her ritual is finished. I doubt those exiled by the right will survive long outside. Uh, well, if no one's looking for him, I can do it. Would you? I would give anything to see Holson return home. Uh, no need to fret, I'll find him. Sylvanas's blessing upon you. And my gratitude as well. <laughs> Hulsin is an elf with the presence of a bear. He left west with the adventurers. You won't mistake the first druid for anyone else. Very good. Oh, we also need to find Nettie. I wish I could offer more assistance. For now, I must keep a close watch on Korga. Ah, okay. I hope to see both you and Hulsin again soon. You guys. Them once. Oh, mate. There she is. What will the tieflings want next? Letting the hell child go was a mistake. Ah, yes. You're the reason. Oh, the druids suck. Hello, Nettie. You're going to try and what kill us word? this time? I see you. Just give me a moment. Uh, I shall wait patiently. 
This medicatrix. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? I'm uh, looking for Nettie. You found her, but I still don't know what she can do for you. Uh, well, healing as soon as possible, if you could. Come here. Let's have a look at you. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. Uh, no good way of putting this. I have a tadpole in my head. A tadpole? A mind flare tadpole? Hmm. Yes, you know of them. Can you help me? I... Uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. <laughs> you need to be quick. This way. Need to find a way forward. Ooh, magic door. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Uh, continue. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Well, I'm hoping for something less grave. Okay, so you killed him and laid him out on the table. No. That was Master Hudson. Oh. I pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. Well, what's that plant? Will it help? Uh, she shifts uneasily and has really something it's off. It might. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? Well, I can merge my mind with anyone else that's infected. Victims can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. How'd you pick up the parasite? Uh, Carlson was desperate to find where all this was happening. Yeah, on a ship I was kidnapped and infected. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Uh, what about that branch of yours? But I swear. I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hells was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. Now, you must have learned something from studying them, though. For one, that thing in your head is like nothing we've ever seen from Mind Flayers. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers. Telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Uh, well that's good news, I suppose. Could be. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. All right. You think he's still alive? I think so. I hope so. I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins <laughs> trying to shoot them down. <laughs> you, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. Ah. How's that sound? Well, we're already doing that anyway, so let's go do it. Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. 
All I can say for sure is the all went to the old temple of Saloon. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. All right. Take it one step at a time, Nettie. Come on. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go. Oh, hang on. What's Lazel going to say to us? Poison? Never. I shall slit my own throat if it comes to that. Oh, either way, better death than life as a mind flare. Yes, I will have a warrior's death. Hmm. If not at the hands of my opponents, then at my own. Now let us make haste to a crash. Neither Netty nor Helsin holds the cure we seek. All right. Don't waste a step. Let's go speak to. Gods are watching me. This will all be over. The ritual's almost finished. What if they tried to steal from us? The game. You can definitely see the changes that they've had over the last year. There's a lot more polish to the game at the moment. It's still not finished, obviously, but still. Oh, hey guys, we found your, your kid, and there she is. You ever scare me like that again, and I'll feed you to a knoll. Mom, I'm fine. Stop it. Our little Hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Don't know what we do without her. All sorts of dramatic stuff. It's not much, but here. Know that if you call, we'll come running. No matter what. Uh <laughs> you're right, it's not much. Uh Well, no more light fingered uh antics, right, Arabella? Yeah. I mean, thank you for helping me. Bells, it's our job to get us out of here safely, not yours. Oh. It's my job too. The druids don't care about us. Ooh. No one does. A cherished locket, eh? Look after ourselves. Ah, That's dancing lights. Wants. Cool. That girl. I don't care what Mole says. That was stupid and reckless. All right. Well, I think it's kind of a good stopping point for now because I've got Will and everything else. I think the next person we're going to go pick up is uh, I forgot his name now. Zarian, the uh, the vampire to complete our little uh, quartet or quintet but uh, I'll do do that in the next session but I have to say I'm I'm impressed with the way um, like all the updates and everything that they've done like there's a lot more polished on onto the game a lot more details um, I guess oh there's a fight going on up here I guess we'll seem to find out uh, what else there is as we keep going on. Uh, do you have action surge? No. Boom, bitch. You have good timing. Never been much of a fighter, so wrestling a bugbear would have gone... poorly. But you're not here for heroics, are you? Avernus's stench is all over your skin. Let me guess. Your devil mistress sent you to get her soul coin back. Too bad. I earned it, fair and square. Uh, coin mistress? Yeah, I've been to Avernus, but I'm no devil's servant.
care to explain why you reek of the hells? Yeah, we just came there. Iron Flare reducted me. My ship went straight through Avernus. It was pretty ridiculous. <laughs> Minimum of 30 20. 22! Well, that's quite the story. And I thought I was doomed. Now I feel sorry for you. Here. Take this. It's worth a fortune. But a fortune's not worth much if you're dead. Consider it payment for saving my life. A soul coin, true to its name, holds a mortal soul inside. It serves in the Nine Hells as very valuable currency. And fuel for their motorcycles. <laughs> Sweet. Well, that's new. I don't think that was in the original. But, uh... Yeah. For now, that's where we're going to leave today's session. So, thank you all very much for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe. I have been your humble host, Tim. And be sure to come back for the next session of Aurora Plays Baldur's Gate 3. Mm -hmm.